And in our final item tonight, the Youth Public Authority sponsored the 10th Youth Empowerment Symposium and that's in cooperation with several local and regional partnerships to guide the new upcoming young entrepreneurs to become part of the economic frontier. The two-day symposium aims to gather the top experts with the young generation to provide them with the most important guide, guidelines and new ideas that would help them with the creativity in the field. As usual, Maryam Adwehi has more. Under the sponsorship of the General Youth Association, the 10th edition of the Youth Empowerment Symposium was held and was attended by a large number of young entrepreneurs and owners of startup businesses. Within the framework of its partnership and cooperation with many business institutions in different fields, locally and internationally. A number of startup founders and entrepreneurs to support youth projects to be part of the national workforce presented the roadmap, support and encourage ambitious young entrepreneurs, and provide financial and moral support in order to help them transfer their startup companies into sustainable projects able to extend. The evening provided an opportunity for young entrepreneurs to meet, communicate, and exchange ideas with the most successful entrepreneurs of their fields. The 10th edition celebrated those who started in 2015 and made permanent successful names that are now part of the national business industry. With the rapid development in the world today and despite the geopolitical challenges, the need for regional and local products and services is extremely important. That was shown and proven during the COVID-19 era. The Youth Empowerment Symposium aims to create a competitive, high-quality, productive environment especially with the emergence of new global economic powers over high seas like China, who is now leading the scene as economic tycoon, dominating trade and digital commerce. The state of Kuwait government is providing all the necessary tools for young entrepreneurs to be leaders and part of the new Kuwait Vision 2035. For the news department, this is Maryam Nudwehi.